Liza and welcome to my channel. So for today's vlog, I'll be sharing with you my photo album collection. So some of you may say that this kind of collection may be old-fashioned, pero masaya eh. Masaya mag-collect ng mga photos and then ilagay sa mga photo albums. So at first, hindi ko naman inakala na magiging collection siya. But siguro dahil nauubos na yung film ko and then nauubos din yung photo album, so bili na lang ako ng bili para may paglagyan ng um, album yung mga photos na piniprint ko. And then... I just realized na dumadami na pala yung photo albums ko. And looking back at those photo albums, nakakaaliw yung tignan yung mga lumang photos na kinuhaan ko. And it is something na iba yung feeling compared to digital photos. I'm not sure how do you feel about the digital photos. Pero para sa akin, iba pa rin yung nakaprint na pictures. Kasi hindi siya na-edit na, printed na talaga siya. Well, I did not expect it at first na magiging collection na yung photo album ko. Well, actually, yun yung question ko. Ilan ba dapat yung items na meron ka para masabing collection na siya? Kasi at first, in denial ako if nagko-collect ba talaga ako. But seeing it na dumadami, well, siguro nga baka collection na siya. So, I started very young when it comes to the fascination of taking photos. Well, hindi naman ako pang ano, professional level. Hindi naman ako photographer level. Pero... I just take photos out of hobby and interest. So, I can also share my cameras before. So, that is, so I can also share my cameras on a different vlog. But then, I really take photos out of interest. So, gustong-gusto ko kapag may mga ganap, gusto ko may sarili akong kamerang dala. And not just my own camera phone, I use really the digital, digital camera. So, nung elementary and high school, wala pa naman akong digital camera. So, I only use the film one, the film camera wherein yung iniikot yung gilid para mag-move yung film inside tapos pag pinicture mo um, kailangan maubos yung film and then ipapadevelop mo so pag pinadevelop mo siya yung negative yung ibibigay sa iyo then you can have it re uh, redeveloped again so parang lumalabas yung edad ko sa sinasabi ko di ba pero derms so ayan so nagkaroon ng mga photo albums na online so, yung mga multiply.com, I'm not sure if you're aware of multiply.com. So, I was able to compile a lot of my photos there. Uh, especially, kahit yung physical photo dati sa film camera, ini-scan ko siya dati para magkaroon ng digital copy. And then, come college, nagkaroon ako ng sarili kong digital camera. So, ayun, ang dami kong nabuong album sa multiply na website. Pero, when it had to shut down, I was able to download everything else. And I was really grateful for that opportunity to download all the photos. So, ngayon, ang dami kong kopya ng mga old photos ko. And, nagkaroon ako ng hard drive na puro old photos. And even the new ones, I also have. Then, Facebook. Nagkaroon din ako mga photo albums sa Facebook. Siguro, pa kahit naman din kayo rin. So, naaliw akong gumawa ng mga photo albums sa Facebook ko. Pero, Again, iba pa rin pag physical talaga. And medyo duda kasi ako magpa-print sa labas ng mga photos. Kasi nangyari sa akin dati, nagpa-print ako nung debut photos ko outside. Tapos, dahil mura siya, sa katagalan, nag-yellow yung paper. So, that's it. Hindi quality yung paper, ganyan. So, nakaka... Alam mo yun? Nakakasay, nakakahinayang lang na magpa-print outside. So, paano ako nagkaroon ng maraming maraming album? Actually, meron na akong 10. 10 albums. 10 na ganito. And, bawat isang ganito, you can fit 64 in stock square films. So, yung mga square na picture. So, nakita ko to online. Okay, so, yung hard case, I bought this at Amazon. Kasi, wala pang ganitong accessories before nung lumabas tong printer na to. 
So, gusto ko yung print. Nag-research nag talaga ako ng printers back then. So, ito siya. So, this is the SP. Instax Share SP3. Okay. So, this one films on... Uh, this one... So, this one prints on square films only. So, pinag-isipan ko yung SP Share 1 and 2 for mini, for films na mini. Pero, I realized masyadong maliit yung mini na film for me. So, pero yung mga square na photos, sakto lang siya sa akin. And then, I also bought this Instax SQ6 na, photo, na camera. So, ito naman, nabili ko siya 50 off sa Lazada. So, nung nakita ko siya na 50 off, binili ko na. Kasi, inaabangan ko talaga magkaroon siya ng discount. How does my albums look like? So, iba-iba kasi yung klase ng albums ko. So, this is my very first album na nagkaroon ako. Kasi, this one is kasama nung SP printer. So, this is a special album for me. It's a photo picture book. Kasi, this contains my Christian walk or my Christian journey. So, this is my baptism, my recommitment. Uh, nung nag-join ako ng D-group. And then, makikita mo na lumalaki yung D-group namin. do may ng ibang faces. It's okay. But, nakikita mo yung growth namin with each other. So, ayan. See? That's me. So, isa sa mga goal ko rin, patapos tong video na to, is matuto na ako mag-focus sa mga pinapakita ko sa inyo. <laughs> right. So, ganito talaga yung tsura ng album na nabibili ko online sa Lazada and sa Shopee. So, ayan. So, ang laman niya, 64, 64 pockets. So, pwede ka mag-print. So, anything that you want to print dun sa printer and then point and shoot gamit yung SQ6 na photo or the camera. So, ganyan. Then, I bought markers din para pwede kong sulatan yung pinaka-instax photo. So, why instax? Kasi hindi talaga siya nag-fade. Or kung mag-fade man, sobrang tagal. Pero, hindi talaga nag-fade tong mga instax photos. And it's really good kasi it's best in keeping the memories. And whenever you revisit the photos, eh di naaalala mo rin yung memories with them. So, dati, puro white yung films ko. And then, I saw black films na rin. Then, nagkaroon din ng white marbled films. Maraming films na ngayon yung uh, square. Pero pinakamarami pa rin designs yung mga Instax Mini. Pero masyadong maliit kasi yung Mini for me. Then, meron ding star illumination na frame. So, these are the puppies. So, ayan. Friends, family. So, there. So, syempre, hindi ko naman piniprint din lahat. So, pinipili ko yung mga special na shots and special photos for me. Para pag binalikan ko, eh, di maganda. So, ayan. Tulad nito, very rare na makita mo akong kumakanta. Pero here, is a proof na kumanta ko sa isang bar. Actually, may isa pa. Pero, hindi ko pa na-print ata yun. Then, sa States, when I visited the States, swimming photos. Ito, kuha ng pinsan ko kasi magaling siyang kumuha. Though, I feel awkward in front of the camera pag kinukunan mo ko ng maganda. Pero siya, she really did it. She really did it very well. She made me very comfortable in front of the lens. Next is I have two different albums here. These are actually notebooks, and these notebooks are handcrafted or not really handcrafted. Pero the design in front is calligraphy to ng best friend ko. So this one is the first gift that she gave me. Sobrang tagal na nito, tapos hindi ko alam kung paano ko siya gagamitin. Actually, may isa akong durabox na puro notebook na walang laman. Kasi, hindi talaga ako susulat na notebook, but I love collecting notebooks. So, ayan. So, I found a purpose for this one. I use this as a photo album. So, I was a volunteer in Big Fridays back in 2018 as a facilitator. And dito ko dinidikit yung every Friday na group photo namin. So, para na rin akong nag-a-attendance. <laughs> then, I show this every week sa mga bagong 
uh, kasali sa table ko, or kahit sa mga returnees. So, naaliw silang makita yung mukha nila sa mga pictures na to. And since this is in stocks, and since this is in stocks, uh, one copy lang yung piniprint ko, or one copy lang because of the shot. So, it makes it extra special. So, ayan, ang dami. Nakakaaliw. So, there. And then, the next one, so, this one naman, again, this is calligraphy by my best friend. So, this one is another gift from her. And what I placed here are 4 by 6 photos. Kasi meron akong, binigyan ako ng ano, ng paper, photo paper. And para hindi naman siya masayang, ginamit ko na rin. Actually, pag binuksan mo to, una mo makikita. Si Kim Sok Jin. Okay. So, explain ko bakit ako may ganito. So, this one I got from the BTS exhibition from Map of the Soul 1 or or Mods on E online exhibition. So, this is part of the ticket that I bought for the online concert. And dun sa online exhibition, pag nag-tour ka, meron dun sa may dulo na photo card generator, random photo card generator. So, I pulled Sok Jin. So, ayan. Though, bias ko si Jimin, pero he's a bias wrecker. Okay. So, what's inside here are the 4x6 photos that I love. Ito yung mga gustong-gusto kong binabalikan na photos. May mga photos na wala akong regret na i-print at all. So, this is my best friend. Napakaganda. So, this is one of my favorite photos of us. So, ayan. O, diba? Ang girl ni ate mo. Okay. So, hindi ko ito pinuno kasi niisip ko baka may iba akong ilalagay sa likod na photo. So, maraming maraming photos to. Ayan. So, album siya. Ginawa ko siyang album. So, there. So, ibang photos dito, hindi mo makikita sa albums kasi nakalagay siya sa ref or nakalagay siya sa standy. So, I'll show a video of it kung anong itsura niya. And that's it. That's my photo album collection. So, sa mga wala pang photo album collection, it's not too late to start now. And I promise you, iba pa rin talaga yung feeling na may sarili kang photo album na punong-puno ng memories, physical na photo with your memories. And dun sa mga may photo album collections, let me know. And I really like to meet people like you. I really like to meet people who loves Instax as well. And that's it. Thank you for watching my vlog. See ya!